From the biggest continent to the teeniest island, we all share a love and passion for the power of music. We all have unique experiences with music and its impact on us is deeper than just entertainment. Cultures around the world use music as a mean of expression. The music of the Dominican Republic is especially unique, echoing the island's colorful heritage. The island of Hispaniola was inhabited by the Taino tribe. The Dominican Republic was the first stop Columbus made in the New World and became the first European settlement in 1492. Conflict rose between the native Taino people and the Spanish colonists and slave owners. Under the leadership of a husband and wife team of chiefs, the Tainos resisted Spanish rule until a combination of European diseases and battalions of Spain caused them to fall. Spain ruled the island of Hispaniola until 1975 when the French conquered it. At this time, 90% of the island's population were West African slaves. In 1844, the Dominican Republic won its freedom from French rule and established a representative democracy. In 1930, President Trujillo, a dictator, was elected. He promoted economic development, but it benefited only himself and his supporters, repressing human rights throughout the country. After daring revolts and brave campaigns by the citizens against Trujillo, he was assassinated in 1961. The country has been returned to a democratic state and is fighting to establish commercial and social stability. The Dominican Republic is a stepping stone between America and Central American drug trade. The children of the Dominican Republic suffer from the saddening ramifications of illicit drug trade through gang affiliation. The Dominican Republic has the second largest economy in Central America and the Caribbean. They are primarily dependent on natural resources and government services. Jobs in agriculture and mining are the most prominent and tourism accounts for much of the money that comes into the DR. Economic growth takes place in spite of a chronic energy shortage, which causes frequent blackouts and very high prices. Though they were plagued with economic turmoil in the 80s and 90s, it began steps to recovery in 2007. The Dominican Republic is rich with culture, diversity, and natural beauty. We as Beyond Borders are using music education as a tool to give students an alternative to dangerous negative influences they are exposed to on a daily basis. Through self-expression and creativity, the children will be enabled to reach their full potential. By supporting Project Hero, you are investing in the cultural, mental, social, emotional, and even economic development of the beautiful nation of the Dominican Republic.